Alright, welcome back to the Roman Empire. We're gonna go and do something fairly risky. Uh, we're gonna start pushing in to uh, contingency territory, but we're gonna do it on our terms and our terms only. Obviously, we now have Capua under control with uh, every, all the bells and whistles being uh, built there. We got a couple of things that we can do here. Got a couple more minerals here and there. That is kind of impacting some of our stuff, but nothing that we cannot handle. In the meantime, uh, let's move the fleet. Uh, we should have enough firepower here. Yes, okay. So what I need here is a construction ship. One that is fairly close by. Yeah, that one will do. So let's move this uh, construction ship into the Maelstrom. Jump him in there and then basically get him ready to take the territory. Because our biggest bonus, our biggest advantage is being able to play out of defensively. And as long as we can take the systems and then put one of our stations down, we can effectively push back the enemy, uh, which is what we want anyway. So let's go and do that. Let's hope that uh, as soon as that jump is done... Have you jumped yet? Or did I just literally... I pulled an assigned ship instead. Great, I'm a genius. Uh, Britannia needs a signed ship attached to it. Yep, yeah, exactly. So that was a construction ship. At this point, we may as well build a construction ship at Cyprus itself, because it'll be quicker. So let's just do that. And then uh, move the entire fleet out. The Alliance fleet has a huge amount of firepower on it. Which is pretty much exactly what we need. Uh, we are currently 500 fleet... The Zavon Covenant is dead. Long live the Zavon Covenant. So they're dead. Uh, we have an additional... Starbase capacity, actually. And uh, we should... Minerals. Uh, we should probably also uh, Maintain turn that off. So the Zavon Covenant is now dead, which means that there's a lot of territory for contingency to expand. It also means that we need to start teasing them. Which is exactly what we're going to be doing. So, what's this in here? Uh, what's classes... So what are these classes doing in here? Oh, they're merging. Okay. Kinetic weapon damage, good. Uh, defensive building build speed. Hmm. Uh, naval capacity, of course. That's what we want. Oh, we, have, we can build an additional uh, star base, which is great. Because that means that we can get more naval capacity. Which is definitely not something that we should underestimate. Okay, so our construction ship is done. Let's move everything into Ziff. Our goal is to engage this station and take control of this system. And then let's hope one of the autonomous clusters will attack us. And then we can slowly but steadily gain Attacking control. Whoa, that is a lot of ships. Okay, so. With that out of the way, let's go to our civilian ships. So, let's get this station under our control. It's not being... Oh, it's no surveying going on there right now. That's unfortunate. So let's just jump in here and then we'll just survey the system. Right, let's get in. Where are these guys all going? Following the first expeditionary fleet. Well, it's only 17,000 fleet power. It's not the end of the world. That I was a bit afraid of. Contingency fleet immediately jumping in. Not that it matters. As long as we can blow up their ships quickly and efficiently. Losses. Destroyer. Two destroyers, two battleships. That's unfortunate. We lost two battleships in that. From which fleet? Legio 5, so that is our Alliance fleet, so not the end of the world, thankfully. Alright, cool, let's get the science ship in here, let's survey the system, let's get the other ships in here. Now we're just waiting for them to jump in on us. Okay, so we got another one moving in right now. Let's hope that we can have enough time to survey everything. We know, where, we know where they're coming in from, so at least that's our advantage. But we need to gain control of the system. 
That is our biggest concern right now. Okay, let's... How many... We don't have enough minerals for more battleships right now. They'll be jumping in here soon. But at least we've regenerated all of our ships. Let's try to get a little bit closer. To the jump point. They are probably very close, yeah. Oh, good lord. There's two ships, two fleets moving in right now. That even means that we need to we need to get the system oh, under system our control. Started. We need to get the star base done, and we need to get it done now. Because we need to use it for f a defensive perimeter. Okay, come on, build the star base. We need the bonus from. Are you coming? Okay, there's the first one. Destroyed. God damn it. We lost the scientist. You, why are you why the hell are you running away? Oh good lord. That's another war form. This this is gonna be a pretty devastating one. <sighs> okay. Let's get the star base up and running. Losses. Five destroyers, two cruisers, two battleships, one battleship. A lot of battleships lost there, but we will rebuild them anyway. Production targets. I'm the various acquisition. Any fresh... Oh god, another one. Let's hope we can build this quick enough. Because another fleet of contingency is moving in. Our armor is regening, but how for how long is this going to be practical? And if it is continuously losing scientists, then this is becomes a serious problem. Seventy percent. Come on, let's give me give me bulwark of harmony. Give me that twenty percent bonus. Ten percent. Of course, zero it finishes. Oh, and I destroyed. destroyed the zero-G construction system. That is super annoying. Okay. Like we have the resources to reinforce relatively quickly. Okay, losses. Cruisers. Mostly cruisers. One battleship. Not a bunch of cruisers. Firepower is relatively quickly waning right now. Are they moving in another one? No. Okay, for now, it looks like they're tuckered out. That's good. Just need to get this construction ship online. And then we can slowly start skipping into... Uh, Ragoin or whatnot. So let's get the starbase going. Uh, let's have this sign ship ready to jump in after it. And then we can take control of whatever we need. But still, as long as we can get these systems under control and contingency doesn't try to come in, and we need Grand Fleet, obviously. Okay, so we lost 150 fleet power in that little ordeal. Now what we can do with this is we can go into our fleet manager and start removing cruisers, adding more battleships where necessary, which we needed to do anyway. Yeah, the Hestadi. For some reason, the Corvettes are actually surviving fairly long. 
Uh, let's just move the Hestadi completely. As well as the Legionaries, they're just... Fodder at this point. Uh, fourth Legion... Hmm. Wait, can I... Add another Titan? Really? Interesting. Uh, yeah, oh, 19 battleships. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. Okay, let's start then reinforcing our various legions. Yeah, we we don't we we haven't just we're just missing quite a lot of fleet power here, which is unfortunate to say the least. But as soon as we can take control of the system, which will be very soon, construction complete. Good. Let's get in. Okay, so we got the system under control. So we can put all these into orbit. So that's good. And they'll just hell regen and whatnot. So that's 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 nice. We still we still got almost two hundred and sixty thousand fleet power there, and we just got fleet logistician as well, which is always nice. But yeah, so we're going to need to push contingency a little bit more. Now they're completely stuck in this sector, which means that we can take a single system without too many problems. It's just a case of when is their reinforcement cycle happening. Like, Roganoin is, at least as I can see it, one of their key systems. Like, everything kind of revolves around this. If we can take several of them down, we can try to make a push for uh, Autonomous Cluster 01 and a Sterilization Hub. But that's still quite a ways away. What the hell is this? Where are you going? Zatar. Okay, that's too far away to be interesting for us. Now, we got a couple of transport ship flips, fleets here as well that we could potentially take out. But in all honesty, all their capital worlds are completely condensed to the northern area of the map. With one capital world down here as well. Oh god, the Renar Council is being eaten alive. Like, one contingency planet I can take care of. That is not a big problem. Yes. It's when we start to get into situations where I'm just like, well, that's... So, uh, it's a lot of dudes that we're fighting, and then, uh, then we're kind of running into problems. We lost the Titan? No. That's the Legatus Leones. Can we build, still build another Titan? Let's take a look here. Latium. No, we cannot. That's unfortunate. But we still have the Alliance Fleet Titan as well, so... Yeah. The Ks are... The Caesar. Okay, so we have Bulwark of Harmony on our side, thankfully. Tactical retreat. So we should be able to come out on top of this a lot easier than before. Even though they've they have basically just wiped the friggin' system. Great. Alright, that's unfortunate. Losses. One Corvette. Bunch of corvettes and one battleship, so that is totally overcomable. So they, they are really focusing down these um, these star bases, and it's going to cost me quite a lot of resources to get that running. So let's just get an endless stream of science ships ready. So. We could push. Yeah, let's push. Let's push into the next system. Like the more the more of an advantage we can get, the better inside of their systems. So there we go. So they are not engaging as of right now. That's good. So, 
the star base is being built. At least it should be built. Okay, so let's get a star base in here. And the science ship lets survey in here. I will do the same with all these northern areas as well. Entering orbit of Orkunfun. Okay, so they're not really pushing in this area. This is all territory that I could potentially take if I really wanted to. Okay. Let's uh, try to consistently reinforce. So, okay, so this system is looking good. We're going to turn Roganoid into a fortress. This is going to be our outpost to Construction basically complete. try to bash contingency over the head. Star system charted. So let's get this outpost built ASAP. Okay, so you are. Okay, so let's get the mining stations underway here as well. Okay, so we got Achia just doing its thing. Maybe we can send out one of the sign ships out, actually. Yeah, let's do that. Uh, how many leaders do we have? We can afford an extra one. Okay. So, let's go to Asia, get a sign ship up and running. I don't want to send... Oh, what's this? They are moving to Achia. That is a problem. Okay, let's hope that we still got the advantage. Jumping into over here is dangerous to say the least, because now we lose support in Cyprus. How far away are you guys? Construction complete. Okay, we're across the system. We're just waiting for this cooldown to finish, basically. Okay, where are you guys going to be coming from? Okay, there they are. Okay, so a couple of euthanizers. A lot of protons being shit in their general direction. Fleet down. Losses? Mostly Corvettes. We lost the Titan. Legio 5 lost the Titan. Okay, the Alliance fleet lost the Titan. Which class? We lost the Remus class. We need to rebuild that ASAP. Let's go to our shipyards. Um, Ladium. We are lacking resources, so we need to build a Romulus ASAP. Let's... I'm really concerned about... Okay, where are you going? You're not doing anything right now? Okay. Aggressive stance, aggressive stance. Margadis. Where is that? Maragatus. Okay, you're going down there. That's fine. Then we got those autonomous clusters over there. This one is just hanging out for no reason whatsoever. So, Raganoin. Gonna be a backup ship. Construction complete. Area. Let's move everybody into Cyprus. Entering hyperlane. Olimar. Moving to Olimar. Where is that? That's completely on the other side of the map. That's near Tampere. Which is also a city in um, in Finland, by the way. Where are you guys going? Are you serious? Am I really going to need to disengage my largest fleet to take care of these goddamn fanatics? Well, it looks like it's going to be the case. How fast can they get there? Reasonably. Spaceport under attack. Yes, I'm aware. Thank you. How powerful is Cyprus right now? 63. Okay. 
In the meantime, we're just forced to reinforce this, our fleet just by ridiculous amounts. Um, anybody we can trade with. Let's take a look here. Nope, that's not a good deal. Uh, Zanam or Capua. Let's cancel this building and replace it with a. Why am I not allowed to replace it with a resource replicator? Because I don't have enough resources, apparently. There's capacity overload, as expected. Let's re-engage that. And this needs to be a resource replicator. Yes. Okay. Okay. Are they still just fuck? construction vessel under attack. Yeah, I was afraid of that. Okay, so they are fucking around in this system right now. Uh, so annoying. Oh, and one of our admirals has died, of course. Good timing. They're just claiming a bunch of systems for no reason whatsoever. They've taken Armenia completely? In you know, just a... Not the planet. Just a system. That is so weird. Let's just jump through the gate. Let's be done with this. I don't want to fuck around with them much longer. So, where are they go? Where do they go? Oh, okay, so they're in the nebula. No wonder we can't see them. So, we don't have vision inside of the nebula right Any now. Exactly, that's what I thought. So, it's 53,000 versus our 60,000. Construction complete. Uh, could be a little bit tight. Oh, God damn it! they're just taking systems really quickly right now. Okay, that's really annoying. Enemy presence exposed. Okay, where are you guys? Why did they not jump through the gate yet? Come on, guys. We don't have time for this. Okay, so they're through. There's just a bunch of destroyers as well. Come on. This should not be hard. So annoying that this this is this sort of stuff just happens. Uh, let's get another Titan online as well. I lost the Rima. I lost the Romulus, didn't I? Yes. So let's get a Romulus class Titan. Good. Now the other stuff that we can reinforce there would be good. Okay. So. Jumping across, a bunch of battleships, Titan, f Corvettes. Yes. Because we got a hundred and... Technology secured. Okay, what do we got? Explosive weapon damage, because we've used that so much. Armor on 90 months. Let's do it. More armor is good. Oh, God. We're going to lose Rogoin again. Because of this, these shenanigans. Okay. As long as the first Legion is in a good position, I don't really care. So... Yeah, this is a decent amount of firepower. It's just a, this Legion over here. Oh! <gasps> They did not. Oh, for a second there, I thought they would jumped into. Where are you guys Station going? Under attack. Zero G mineral production violently diminished. 
Attacking enemy assets. Interesting choice. Where do they go? Where you guys are? Where are you guys going? Rucklure. Where the hell is that? Rucklar. Okay. Any particular reason for that? Mythar two. Something. Something. What was Mythar two? Mythar. Okay, so because contingency is now knocking on your door, you all of a sudden realize, yeah, I should probably go home. Yeah, that makes sense. All right, then we need to take back our stations. Yeah, these guys have just realized that they've horribly fucked up and that they need to go home now, which is fine. Yeah. This is just annoying, entering Ziff. Yeah, that's fine. Uh, what? No, this, this is the route you're taking. Yeah, they, these guys... It's finally here! Yet another in... Yet another intensive energy spike has been detected in a previously uncharted system. The energy levels are equivalent to those that we registered when the contingency activated its machine worlds. But the energy signature itself appears different. Could this be signify the appearance of some kind of new contingency weapon system? We are picking up a strong transmission. We are Cybrex. For several hundred thousand cycles, we have remained hidden and uninvolved in galactic affairs. However, we have been monitoring the present situation with the machine entity that you know as, you know as the Contingency. And we can no longer remain impartial observers. To protect sapient beings in the galaxy, we are commencing active, uh, commencing active military operations against Contingency. Do not be alarmed by the passes of our fleets. You will not be harmed. Contingent, uh, it looks like Cybrex has joined us. Where are they? Cybrex. Cybrex. Cybrex Remnants. Where is this? Well, we're gonna wrap up the- oh, there they are. They're all the way up here. Cybrex Beta. We are gonna wrap up the episode here. That's, uh, Cybrex have joined us now, which is gonna be very helpful, to say the least. So let's hope that, uh, they're going to be capable of uh, supporting our fleets a little bit and attacking the contingency fleets. My god, they've respawned again. That's, uh, that's a lot of firepower that they got. Well, we're just going to try to hold them off for now. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, take good care of yourselves. And as always, eat shutter.